If you're an e-commerce business, you must be familiar with Shopify. Today, thanks to Pop-Up Smart's 10 years of experience, I will compare seven different e-commerce platforms according to their price, transaction fees, themes and customization, apps and marketplace, community, support, security, SEO, and lastly performance and speed. Let's begin! First, let's start with the pricing of WooCommerce. WooCommerce is free, but you have to consider hosting and maintenance costs, which could be pricey compared to Shopify in the long term. When it comes to transaction fee, WooCommerce could be a better choice because it doesn't charge any. As you may know, Shopify's transaction fee starts from 0.5%. Let's continue with teams and customization. WooCommerce has 48 teams, 3 free and others starting from $39. Design-wise, we can say that it's not as polished as Shopify's, however, teams are fully customizable if you're not technically challenged. When it comes to apps and marketplaces, WooCommerce has thousands of plugins. However, you have to be really careful as it's open source and open to outside attacks. Next up is Community. WooCommerce has a community page where you can join virtual meetings and watch live shows. However, it's not on the same level with Shopify's huge community numbers. When we check out the support systems, we can see that WooCommerce doesn't have a central support system, but if you want live help, you can purchase plugins. And when we look at Shopify, we see that it provides 24-7 guidance. Considering SEO, WooCommerce has good plugin options. We can say that it's on the same level with Shopify, if not better, thanks to WordPress. Security is another criteria that we are discussing. In WooCommerce, you basically create your own security by using plugins. However, you have to be really careful as a small mistake like using unsafe apps can make your site open to outside attacks. Our last criteria is performance and speed. The thing is, WooCommerce is based on WordPress, which has so many users around the world and the number of users may make your site perform slower. Plus, its vulnerability to outside attacks may make your site even slower, unlike Shopify. Price is one of our main criteria. Similar to Shopify, BigCommerce offers a standard plan for $29.95. And again, just like Shopify, if you want to try it out first, BigCommerce has a 50-day free trial. When it comes to transaction fee, BigCommerce is really advantageous compared to Shopify, which has 0.5% transaction fee minimum. Because BigCommerce doesn't charge any transaction fees if you use the leading payment gateways. Next up, teams and customization. BigCommerce has nearly 200 teams, 12 free and others starting from $150. It's not open source, but you have customization options using drag and drop page builder. Plus, checkout customization is also possible with BigCommerce, but Shopify does not have such options. Next, we have apps and marketplace. BigCommerce has over 600 apps in its marketplace. It's smaller than Shopify, but since it has so many built-in features, we can say that it's efficient. Plus, not depending on so many third parties means low costs. When it comes to community, BigCommerce has a community page where you can find question and answer part and join virtual meetings to interact with other people. Still, it has a long way to catch up with Shopify's enormous community numbers. Our next criteria is support. Just like Shopify, BigCommerce offers guidance 24-7 via live chat, email and phone. Let's continue with SEO. BigCommerce might be better than Shopify in terms of SEO providing features such as changing URL structures and editing robots.txt files. Let's talk about security. BigCommerce offers an uncompromising security. All stores are protected by multiple security layers like firewalls, file integrity scanners, and intrusion detection. 
we can say that security-wise, BigCommerce stands out amongst others by fulfilling its promise. Finally, performance and speed. Both platforms load really fast. Shopify might be a little faster, but BigCommerce's average load time isn't bad at all. In this sense, we can say that they are on the same level. Let's start off with the price plan. Wix offers a 14-day free trial with all premium plans. Its basic plan starts at $23, which is slightly cheaper than Shopify's. Plus, Wix offers more features for its basic plan. Transaction fee is also a criteria to consider. Wix has 2.9% plus 30 cents transaction fees, which is higher than Shopify. But note that if you use Wix payments, you will not be charged any transaction fees. Following criteria is themes and customization. Wix has hundreds of well-designed templates for you to use, so you can choose one for your tastes. Its customization options are similar to Shopify, however, EditorX.com provides better options if you like further customization. When we check out App and Marketplace, we see that Wix has over 300 apps. Still, it's outperformed by Shopify, which has 700 apps and counting. Let's continue with community. Wix has over 3,000 posts and 12,000 members in its community. However, when we check out Shopify, we see that it has more than a million posts and nearly a million members. Wix and Shopify has similar support systems except for the live chat. Wix offers live chat during the business hours only. However, Shopify is ready 24-7. SEO optimization of Wix is limited like Shopify. However, we need to mention additional keyword research which Shopify does not have. Now it's time to talk about security. Wix has multiple security layers for protection. Firewalls and intrusion detection are in place to prevent unauthorized access. In this sense, it's very comparable to Shopify. Our last criteria is performance and speed. Wix loads a little slower than Shopify, but when we check desktop and mobile speed, Wix offers a slightly higher speed rating. First off, price plan. Compared to Shopify's free plan, Equid's starting plan is cheaper. It's $15 monthly and you can have up to 10 items and 2 product categories. The best part is, you can keep the free plan as long as you want. Next up, transaction fee. Equid doesn't have a transaction fee, which is a huge plus compared to Shopify, where the minimum transaction fee starts from 0.5%. Let's continue with teams and customization. Equid has more than 70 predefined teams. You have some customization options, but we can say that they are limited. For further changes, you will need coding or apps. Now it's time for apps and marketplaces. In Equid App Market, you can find more than 40 free and premium apps. Still, when we compare to Shopify, we can say that it's smaller as Shopify has more than 7,000 apps. When we compare their communities, we see that Equid has nearly 3,000 members over the messaging app Slack. Plus, it has Equid Academy where you can take courses on e-commerce. Still, we can say that Shopify's community game is stronger compared to Equid with a million posts and nearly a million members. When it comes to support, Equid provides limited options to its lower price plans. Phone calls and live chats are reserved for premium customers. Compared to Shopify, support system may not be satisfactory. When it comes to SEO, Equid provides SEO-friendly URLs out of the box. It has the technical side covered for you. All stores are optimized for search engines by default. But still, you have the ability to change URL structures and meta tags manually, which is not the case with Shopify. Security-wise, Equid stores its data on Amazon Web Services, so it's hard to tell one is more secure than the other as Shopify also enforces multiple security steps. 
The last one is performance and speed. Regarding the customer reviews, we can say that Edward loads slower than Shopify. Still, we should remember that the speed of your website is directly related to the number of contents and plugins you have. Starting with the plan, ICAS provides a 14-day free trial with ICAS branding. Its basic plan starts at $39 monthly, which is higher than Shopify. Transaction fee of ICAS is added on top of your Stripe rate, which can be similar to Shopify's when compared. When it comes to teams and customization, ICAS is a little bit outperformed by Shopify since it has a limited number of teams that can be customized. When it comes to apps and marketplaces, ICAS doesn't have an app store, so it's a little bit hard to add new features to your website. Still, they're always developing their system. In the community category, ICAS doesn't have much, so in this sense we can say it has a place to grow to reach Shopify's level. When it comes to support, ICAS has a support page where you can get help. Still, it may not be satisfactory compared to Shopify's 24-7 help options. For SEO, ICAS has better options than Shopify such as changing product and collection URLs. Next up, security. ICAS provides free SSL and makes sure all the sites are protected by multiple security layers. In this sense, we can say that it's comparable to Shopify. Last stop, performance and speed. ICAS claims that it's lightning fast, out of the box, without any codes or apps. And customer reviews prove it correct. So we can say that ICAS is the front runner in this category. Illusion and Shopify go head-to-head -head in terms of pricing. They both provide a free trial and their basic plan starts at $29 per month. Still, if you want a lower pricing, Illusion is a better choice because of Shopify's subscription costs. Our next criteria is transaction fee. Illusion's transaction fee is 1.25%. We cannot say that it's any better than Shopify because Shopify's transaction fee starts from 0.5%. When we come to teams and customization, we see that Volusion has 45 teams, 11 free and others starting from $180. If you want further customization with your teams, they provide an implementation expert which is rather expensive. So compared to Shopify, we can say that it has less options but is more expensive. Volusion offers 70 applications in its marketplace. Still, we can say that it has a long way to go to catch Shopify with 7,000 apps in the marketplace. Let's get to the community. Volusion doesn't have a community but it has help center, blog and educational resources if you want further information. Still, it may not be enough since Shopify's community has nearly a million members and more than a million posts. Next up, support. Volusion has 24-7 technical help, just like Shopify. However, if you want advanced assistance, you need to upgrade to a higher plan, which is not the case with Shopify. Let's continue with SEO. Although it's less SEO friendly than Shopify, Volusion provides search term analysis, which lets you see what the customers are actually looking for on Google. Still, it needs to step up its SEO game to compete with Shopify. It's now time to discuss security. Volusion's customized firewall settings allow you to block certain traffic to your data to prevent spam and give trustworthy tracking data. So in this sense, we can say that it's as secure as Shopify. Our last criteria is performance and speed. Volusion is designed for speed as its sites are hosted on the servers that are specifically designed to handle heavy traffic and load quickly. Still, we should remember that as for all e-commerce platforms, the speed depends on the content on your website. Starting with the price plan, we see that Webflow offers a free trial and its basic plan starts at $15 per month. In terms of pricing, we can say that it's an excellent Shopify alternative. Then there is the transaction fee. 
Vaclaw charges an additional 2% transaction fee on the standard plan. However, if you upgrade to a higher plan, there is no transaction fee, which is a good thing compared to Shopify where transaction fee applies differently on each plan. Let's talk about teams and customization. Webflow offers over a thousand teams that you can customize using its code tree design tools. Webflow is the clear winner of teams and customization category with over 40 free templates. We can see that Shopify has 76 teams, 8 free and others starting from $150. When it comes to apps and marketplaces, we see that Webflow doesn't actually have a store, which could be a challenge in comparison to Shopify that has an app market with over 7,000 apps. Now, let's talk about community. Webflow has one-of-a-kind Webflow University and 75,000 members, so we can say that it's really ambitious and as you know, Shopify has a community page where you can find more than a million posts and there are a million members. Let's move on to support. From Monday through Friday, you can have email assistance from Webflow. However, getting a quick answer is really difficult, so it could be inconvenient compared to Shopify's fully functional support system. Then there is SEO. When compared to Shopify, Webflow is actually very SEO friendly. You can change and update page names and descriptions. Fine tuned controls, high performance hosting, and adaptable content management tools are all possible with Webflow. Now, let's take a look at security. All Webflow sites come with built-in SSL, so there is no need to update or manage risky plugins. In this sense, we can say that it's really comparable to Shopify. Lastly, we have performance and speed. Webflow has over 100 data centers throughout the world to ensure that your site loads quickly for each visitor. In this sense, it's easily comparable to Shopify.